This is the Gaumont British News, presenting the world to the world. The Gold Cup on the third day of the Ascot meeting is one of the most coveted of all the prizes of the turf. But once again the weather played a part which almost swamped the interest in the race itself. As on the first day, there is no drive over the course, the royal party arriving by car. The appearance of Brantome, the French horse, is the big thrill for the day. Brantome has an unbeaten record in France and has come here to collect another trophy. Brantome is number 13, last but one on the parade. Only six runners left the starting gate, K. Manus, Alcazar, Denver the second, Tiberius, Bright Bird and, of course, Brantome. The French horse started odds on favourite, but something seems to be wrong. Bright Bird is leading with Tiberius and Alcazar also in front of the favourite. It may be that fast living is getting him down because Brantome is the young spark that gave his trainer the slip at Chantilly and spent the night at the casino or somewhere. But perhaps he's going to do something very dashing in the last few furlongs. Coming to the straight, Tiberius is leading from Alcazar, followed by Denver the second, with Brantome mucking about at the back. Last but one, he thinks he's still in the parade. His jockey expected him to win by ten lengths, but he's ten lengths on the wrong side. Tiberius wins, and poor old Brantome, if he'd been much later, he'd have needed a rear light. 